2021 was the most eventful year of our lives. We started it in Costa Rica, visiting the land we just purchased in an eco community. We are finally gonna get to see the lot in Alegria that we put the deposit down on. Seeing our new home for the first time was already such a special moment, but Louis also had other plans. Today is the day I propose to Raya and I'm pretty nervous. Look, I'm shaking a little bit. Would you marry me? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Yes. <laughs> <laughs> then came another life-changing decision. We moved into our converted school bus. And now we're gonna, yeah, take it back onto the road and live on it full time, right? Yeah. Made some major upgrades, like building a huge roof deck and started an epic road trip across the US. Look at the size of this Joshua tree. Good morning from... Quartzsite, Arizona. Moab, Utah. Colorado. We visited 17 states as we crossed from California to New York and got to see so much more of the US that we'd never seen before. We're going to the Grand Canyon today. This has been like on my bucket list for as long as I can remember. You turn up. Oh my gosh. Stay in a tree house. Oh wow. How we shower while living in a school bus. Louis also launched a new project, his new podcast channel, where he takes influencer friends to see exciting social projects in his homemade electric van. Time to switch the keys. Then we swapped homes with Kara and Nate for a day. Our bus for their van. Cheers. Hey, Thank yeah. you for coming home. We loved it so much that... We moved out of our school bus and into a van. On the other side of the world. We both have family in Europe that we hadn't been able to see in over a year and a half. So we decided to spend the summer taking on an incredible road trip from London to Bulgaria. Good morning, Paris. I'm gonna try to wash my hair in the sink. This is like in the hairdressers. My gosh. Both of us were born and raised on this continent, but we got to see it in such a different way on this trip. We are about to go paragliding. Cinque Terre, Italy. Positano, Italy. This is the least visited country in Europe. Some of the world's largest and oldest pyramids. <laughs> this is so exciting. <laughs> Bosnia and Herzegovina. <laughs> wow. This is so, so epic. My grandparents grow a lot of their own food. My parents are taking the van from us and driving it all the way back to the UK. Before we went back to our school bus, we took a quick trip to Costa Rica to choose our wedding venue and thought we'd try another vehicle to live in. We moved into a 4x4. Four four. In Costa Rica! We have arrived at the Sloth Sanctuary. And for our last big trip of the year, we flew to Kenya for work and took a memorable train ride. This is like a safari train ride. It's incredible. Spent 24 hours living on a sailboat. Whoa. Wow. Wow and had the most magical wild animal interactions of our lives. We're visiting the Sheldrick Wildlife Trust. It's an elephant orphanage where they rehabilitate baby elephants and then release them back into the wild. We've seen a leopard, a young leopard. 
I don't think anything's going to beat this in terms of no. kind of nature, wildlife interaction. After all of the international adventures, we finally came back to the US and relived our first weekend together seven years later and finally moved back onto the bus. There are some pretty significant upgrades that we need to finish. Installing an AC unit, some new solar panels, a whole new power system. Turn this into like a home gym. And making it feel like home again. As always, this year was full of highs and lows. It's a bit of a disaster. Van life has been taking a toll on our relationship. Biggest travel fail by far. That we've ever had. Shit, look, there's water getting in the car. <laughs> and we shared them all with you. Thank you for being there for us and supporting us all year. In 2021, our subscribers on this channel grew by 90,000 people. It's because of you that we get to live the life we've always dreamed of. And we cannot wait to share so much more in 2022. Make sure to subscribe if you're not already. And we'll see you next week.